And it, what? Oh. I have a very large <clears throat> finger. And Zach got a very large head. And <laughs> 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 so you're laughing at it. So what, what What would you look for? What do you... Todd Mark and Hanson. <laughs> Something not physical. Nice. Because, I mean, you're not going to, you're not going to probably even give somebody that you're not attracted oh, no. to a funny. second chance. Funny. So you're going to, you're going to find. Very funny. Funny um, and nice. You're going to find somebody that's attracted to you, number one. You're not even going to give somebody else. So once you find somebody that's attractive, then you go to kind of. Mm -mm. You're not, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you find out who they are, what they're like, right? What would be a, what kind of thing should you look for? <laughs> Hopefully somebody who can laugh at not being buried. <laughs> Somebody that's got a good spoon. Rita was like, boy, she was like, I do have a good spoon. I want my spoon. <laughs> no, my spoon. Give it to her. Stop. <laughs> so what about somebody with a... We can break your camera. <laughs> huh? Somebody with a Look at it, you. A tip for him. Would that be somebody to look for? Uh-uh. No, uh-uh. <laughs> no, this one. This one, last night. Ask him what happened last night. Is that what he's asking you? I'm not attracted to your brother. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> Do that again. <laughs> Do last night this thing. You're going to go mad. It's one of those cupcakes! Can I have another one? <laughs> <laughs> no, because of the cupcakes you ate. It's all the cupcakes that you haven't eaten. That'd be your fourth one. So that sugar oh, is. Oh, you told me gold that you had three. Okay. You want some? Hey. Now give me. I don't have none. Now. One. Two. <laughs> <laughs> I would have swatted that. You too. So guys, guys, do you want to get the curly to get the fly? Guys, quit smacking. Guys, so listen. What kind Marina. Of what kind of what kind of personality? A girl that can bench press 500. <laughs> personality. We're not talking about. <laughs> That's my shirt. <laughs> I never wear college shoes on the hill. So, uh, <laughs> Ben Chris, nine million pounds. Personality. Somebody that's a smart aleck and always yeah, never says anything nice to you. They can take their bags well, and wait. They're only smart aleck and they gotta say nice things. And they gotta take a slap. <laughs> you gonna put your wife leader on before you get <laughs> 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 Sit on the front porch. Did he really just say that last? Yeah. yeah. He'd be like, Karina, we're going to be my new wife. I know you better than that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> No, when Junior has a girl, he's like, he's different when he has a girl. Whenever she gets that wet towel after you, she's yeah. like a little girl. <laughs> 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 the honeymoon. You better get me bitten all that. I know. Mommy! No, you give me that camera now. <laughs> so let's look at it. So let's look at it. You're going to the so uh, you, you, you already broke your family has already got two old, two or three older siblings to look at, right? Three. Yeah. Three. Hey, you got an older brother, don't you? Nico, Janet, and Lupe. Yeah. Oh, I don't know the older. No, I don't either. I just know that. Nico. So have, is he married? Yep. He has already had yeah, two kids. Two kids. What's what's his life like? Pretty good. She's awful. She's mean. She is mean. <laughs> she is. One says pretty good, and two says she's mean. I tried to talk to my brother and she just interrupted all that. Hi! When? I went out of the state at the guy's house. When? When? I'm going to pick up mom from well, Mexico. We stay at night. Yeah, we did. We, we stayed, stayed at his like house. Five. We stayed at like five. It was me. I remember that night. Oh, yeah, I remember y'all stayed at her. Oh, I didn't get to go. I don't remember I'm picking so y'all up, though. Janet? What kind of advice did Janet give you about? I don't know, she gives us too many, I don't know. So like Eric, Eric and her, are they still together? No. No, they broke up. She's riding solo. Riding solo. Uh, so was that, was that a healthy relationship? Her, mm -hmm. her and Eric? Mm -mm. How come? Because he's a loser. Because they thought he was weird. Who did? No, he just... I'm because he what? thought he was with her, he thought he didn't have to talk to her. He didn't have to do what? Talk Read to her. her on TV. No, don't mess with Talk it. Talk to her. Yeah. What?
No, no come here. Me. That was a scary face. Oh my god, no. they were together? He thought nah. because of that, he didn't need to like, talk to her all the time and stuff. So he would, he didn't maintain the relationship, is that what you're saying? Mm -hmm. No. He, go. he, he had a me day every day. He I said no. Day. He had himself day. You know no. what he did himself? Every We're going to go no. buy fish crap for his fish tank. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, too. Yeah, they're horrible. They're nasty. It's on Facebook. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> what is it, Magali? I got a secret to tell you. I like pie. So what about DJ? DJ and Lupe. How's that? Uh, <laughs> don't even get on that subject. I am. Why? I'll go get you some tea. I'd say some things that she did that thing. Nope. Uh, okay, well, one thing I've learned, and it's taken me a long time to learn this. They jacked right. my Xbox 360 game. Listen, Junior. GTA 4. Modern you, need really Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> you need to listen, really. One thing I've learned is that me until I was about 40 years old to learn this. Aren't you 40 now? Yeah. Listen, get your hand out of the way. I'm squeezing him. Stop it. There's some really good books and learning about family dynamics. And so if you... I, and let me say this. Every family that I've ever known and I think you can say every family has some dysfunction. You know what dysfunction means? Dysfunctional relationships. What are dysfunctional problems. relationships? Very <coughs> problematic relationships. Yeah. Do them things. What's the what's the okay. what's God's best for relationships? What's God's ideal and best for a relationship? Man yeah. and woman. Perfect. And God yeah. and alive. What what are they? What what would be the best? Skill. What's, what are men commanded, husbands to commanded to do to their wives? Uh, Slap them and hit them? No. <laughs> We're that would be the worst. <laughs> We're commanded to love. The men are commanded to love. Why are we commanded to love? <laughs> to reproduce. No, 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 no. Now love and agape. You remember agape? I was shooting Michelangelo. Oh, hey, there's like, there's like I thought four, there's like four, four three words for love. L-O-V-E-L-O-V-E there's, there's Eros, which that's the sexualized love. Isn't there's, that a... There's, there's brotherly type love, and that's Phileo. Snooky. And there's this acquaintance love called Sturge. <laughs> but there's Stop. this... But there's this... Doing the best for others type of love that Jesus had. <laughs> Jesus had this kind of love for the disciples and everything. It's called agape. Somebody can't go. when you do the best for somebody. You want Trina. the best for them. So the guys are commanded to love their wives. But you know what, wives? 